you would pray the rosary. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, 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 Creator of heaven, heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ. 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 His only mm -hmm. Son, our Lord, who was crucified under Pontius Pilate, was <laughs> right. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, Almighty Creator, Creator of heaven and, and earth, and in Jesus Christ, Christ, His only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered, suffered under, under Pontius, Pontius Pilate, Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. The third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and seated at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From there she shall come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body and life everlasting. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give, Give us, us this day our daily, daily bread and forgive us our trespasses. As we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. For the virtues of faith, hope, and love. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, yes, now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. May lead all souls to heaven, especially those most need thy mercy. O Mary, help me to see God's love for me today. And St. Wilford, pray for us. The first sorrowful mystery, the agony in the garden. In his anguish, he prayed with all great intensity, and his sweat became like drops of blood falling to the ground. Then he rose from prayer and came to his disciples, only to find them asleep, exhausted with grief. <clears throat> Let's offer this up for whom the Mass had been sent for. Marie, is it Marie Rankin? No, that's, that's October. For the souls in purgatory. Poor soul purgatory. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. 
Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins. Save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those who must need thy mercy. O Mary, help me to see God's love for me today. And St. Wilfred, pray for us. The second sorrowful mystery, the scourging at the pillar. Pilate's next move was to take Jesus and have him scourged. Let's offer our prayers up for our nation today as the voters go to the polls and as the and have the the right and the just be elected. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. 
O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those who most need of thy mercy. O Mary, help me to see God's love for me today. And St. Wilford, pray for us. The first sorrowful mystery, the crowning of thorns. They stripped off his clothes and wrapped him in a scarlet military cloak. Leaving a crown out of thorns, they fixed it on his head and struck a reed in his right hand. Let us offer this decade in thanksgiving for our beautiful weather. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our, our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mary, Mother of God, God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Lord, be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those most need thy mercy. O Mary, help me to see God's love for me today. And St. Wilford, pray for us. The fourth sorrowful mystery, carrying of the cross. Carrying the cross by himself, he went out to what is called the place of the skull. Let's offer our prayers up for our children and our children's children and all the future generations that they may come to know and love and serve our Lord Jesus. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those who most need of thy mercy. O Mary, help me to see God's love for me today. And St. Wilford, pray for us. The fifth sorrowful mystery, the crucifixion. Jesus uttered a loud cry and said, Father, into your hands I commend my spirit. After he said this, he expired. Let's <coughs> offer this up for the sick in all our nursing homes and the sick in all our parishes and anyone else who needs our prayers and especially on our prayer, the people on our prayer chain. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give, give us this day our daily bread and, and forgive us our trespasses, trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As, as it was in the beginning, beginning as now, and ever shall, shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those who must need of thy mercy. O oh, Mary, help me see God's love for me today. And St. Wilfred, pray for us. Hail, Hail Holy, Holy Queen, Queen, Mother of Mercy, our life, our sweetness, our, sweetness, our hope. To thee we cry for banished children of Eve. To thee we send of our sides, mourning and weeping this valley of tears. Turn them, most gracious advocate, the nights of mercy towards us. And after this our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, the Holy Mother of God, that we may be worthy of the promises of Christ. O God, whose only begotten Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life. Grant that we beseech thee that meditating upon these mysteries of the Most Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. St. Michael, the Archangel, Archangel, defend us in battle. Be our protection against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, come to pray. And do thou, Prince of the Heavenly Host, by the power of God, thrust into hell Satan and all evil spirits who prowl about the world, seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.
again, I just want to remind everybody that we do have the names of uh, those who have written their uh, loved ones who uh, are, uh, died to be remembered throughout the month of November. So I ask you to keep them in your prayers, if you will. <clears throat> Today's Mass is being offered uh, for the uh, poor souls of purgatory again. So uh, I think it's uh, always a good thing to pray for the dead. It's a noble thing to do. And of course, today is the feast of Saint Vincent, uh, uh, Saint Martin de Poor. I think I'll go ahead and uh, stay with the ordinary time, uh, uh, with uh, one that's in the book. So let us begin with the entrance antiphon: "Forsake me not, O Lord my God; be not far from me. Make haste and come to my help, O Lord my strong salvation." In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, Amen. the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with you all. And with your spirit. Brothers and sisters, let us acknowledge our sins, and so prepare ourselves to celebrate the sacred mysteries. I confess to Almighty God, and to you, my brothers and sisters, that I have greatly sinned in my thoughts and in my words, what I have done and what I have failed to do, through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous fault. Therefore, I ask, Blessed Mary, ever virgin, all the angels and saints, and to you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me to the Lord our God. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. And let us pray. Almighty and merciful God, by whose gift you faithfully offer your gift, your faith, by whose gift your faithful offer you right and praiseworthy service, Grant, we pray, that we may hasten without stumbling to receive the things you have promised through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in unity, Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. Mm. A reading from the letter of St. Paul to the Philippians. Brothers and sisters, have among yourselves the same attitude that is also yours in Christ Jesus, who through though he was in the form of God, he did not regard equality with God something to be grasped at. Rather, he emptied himself, taking the form of a slave, coming in human likeness and found human in appearance. He humbled himself, becoming obedient to death, even death on a cross. Because of this, God greatly exalted him and bestowed on him the name that is above every name, that at Jesus' name every knee should bend of those in heaven and on earth and under the earth, and every tongue will confess that Jesus Christ is Lord to the glory of God the Father. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. I will praise you, Lord, in the assembly of your people. I will praise you, Lord, in the assembly of your people. I will fulfill my vows before those who fear him. The lowly shall eat of their fill, you shall, they who seek the Lord shall praise him. May your hearts be ever, be ever uh, merry. I will praise <clears> you, <throat> Lord, in the assembly of your people. All the ends of the earth shall remember and turn to the Lord. All the families of the nations shall bow down before him. I will praise you, Lord, in the assembly of your people. Your dominion is the Lord's, and he rules the nations. To him alone shall bow down all who sleep in the uh, in the earth. I will praise you, Lord, in the assembly of your people. To him my soul shall live, my descendants shall serve him. Let the coming generations be told of the Lord, that they may proclaim to a people yet to be born the justice he has shown. I will praise you, Lord, in the assembly of your people. And I'm going to have to impose on you to do the Alleluia, if you will. Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. Come to me, all who labor are in burden, and I will give you rest, says the Lord. Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. The Lord be with you. 
and with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke. Glory to you, Lord. One of those at table with Jesus said to him, Blessed is the one who will dine in the kingdom of heaven. He replied to him, A man gave a great dinner to which he invited many. When the time before the dinner came, he dispatched his servants and said to those invited, Come, everything is now ready. But one by one they began to excuse themselves. The first saying to him, I have purchased a field and must go and examine it. I ask you, consider me excused. And another said, I have purchased five yoke of oxen. and I am on my way to evaluate them. I ask you, consider me excused. And another said, I have just married a woman, and therefore I cannot come. The servant went and reported this uh, to his master. And the master of the house in rage commanded his servant, go out quickly into the streets and alleys of the town and bring in here the poor and the crippled and the blind and the lame. The servant reported, sir, your orders have been carried out and there is, there still is, there, and still there is room. The master then ordered the servant, go out to the highways and the hedgerows and make people come in that my home may be filled. For I tell you, none of those men who were invited will taste my dinner. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise, Praise you, Lord, Lord Jesus Christ. <clears throat> Obviously, I'm going to keep the homily short. Maybe that's a blessing in disguise, right? And yes, uh, so there's no uh, worry. It's an ear infection. I have an ear infection. And of course, the doctors were saying, well, you know, with an ear infection, remember, that makes you vulnerable. So highly recommend that you kind of self-isolate until you get over the ear infection, just to make sure. So another abundance of caution, but don't worry, my no worry, receiving communion from me, you're not going to get sick or something like that. It's just an ear infection. The thing I guess I really just want to emphasize is the uh, letter of St. Paul to the Philippians, and it's so relevant for today as this in the 21st century, because he's in the news so much, this, this nonsense, and it truly is nonsense of equality. Everybody looking for equality. And of course, Jesus teaches us something different. He re reminds us that Jesus, who is God, he's completely God. He doesn't have to prove himself to be God. He knows he's God. And like St. Paul says, and so as a result, he did not team equality with God, something to be grasped at. And this is the problem we have with so many people these days. It's like women who are against men and, and the uh, blacks who are against the whites and the Mexicans who are against the whites and, and all that. It's always equality. We're not having equality. You just heard it on TV today from one of the newscasters. And he wanted to look at these individuals and say to them, what's your problem? Don't you know that you're equal? You're equal before God. And what else do you need? Now, what you have to do is put up with those idiots that don't think that you are equal to them. And what you do is reject them. Don't grasp at equality. Don't try to make equality because that just shows you that you're desperate. We don't need to be desperate before God because we are children of God. We are equal in his sight. And he loved us so much that he did send Jesus into the world to bring us our salvation and to be able to invite us to that dinner so that we can all be able to enjoy the dinner that was invited for others. He so generously wants to give to us, especially this meal at the altar. So with that now, let us stand together as the people of God, recognizing that we are the princes and princesses of the kingdom of God, and that we now approach our heavenly father with our thanksgivings, our supplications, especially our prayers. So Heavenly Father, as we now enter in November, we do want to remember to pray for all who have died, especially the poor souls for whom we offering this Mass. Heavenly Father, may those who have died share the promise of Christ's resurrection and share eternal life with you in heaven, the heavenly banquet. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Now, Heavenly Father, we now need your peace. Now that the all this election nonsense is over, now that things will be settled. And now we need to have your peace come into the world so that there's not a, an overpowering that goes on with, uh, with individuals who seek power. And Lord, I have them recognize that you are the power of the universe. And in that peace that we can live together in harmony, we pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Now, Heavenly Father, we now 
do want to pray for those individuals that in your you already know who's been elected and will be taking on the responsibility of the common good. So for those elected officials, may they recognize that they are to be like Christ, to be servants to the servants, and that they will serve the common good according to your will and serve it well. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Now, Heavenly Father, we present you those individuals who serve the church, especially the successors of the apostles. We pray for Pope Francis and Bishop Donald, that they will bring about your kingdom here on earth as it is in heaven. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Now, Heavenly Father, you have a great blessing that you have given us with 70 degree weather. Again, we want to give you thanks for the blessings you have given to our farmers and ranchers. Now they bring in the harvest. Keep them safe as they work in the fields with the equipment and, and the animals, that, that they will have a successful, a plentiful, and, and a profitable harvest this year. We pray to the Lord. Lord, Amen. hear our prayer. Now, Heavenly Father, we present to you those individuals among us who, who are ill, uh, being affected by the coronavirus, those who are also uh, in, in hospice care, making their journey home to you. May they always have the courage to do or the cross they're carrying at this time. And, and yes, we do pray for their quick recovery, if that be your will, that they may return to your altar of praise with us soon, we pray to the Lord. Lord, Amen. hear our prayer. And now that the winter months are going to be setting in, Heavenly Father, we also present to you those individuals who do not have adequate housing, clothing, or food. Heavenly Father, may we recognize those who are in true need to respond to those needs and not just out of want, that they will be able to be, have the dignity that is theirs as, as being a part of the human race. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Now, Heavenly Father, we ask you to help our nation to reject our culture of death and embrace the gospel of life. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Now we present to you those petitions that we hold dearest to our own hearts. For all of these, we pray to the Lord. Lord hear our prayer. God, our Father, again, it is with great joy and pleasure that we come before you with our prayers, knowing that as a good and gracious Father, you hear us when we call out to you. Now make perfect what is imperfect. Now they are presented to you through our mediator, Jesus Christ, our eldest brother, our Lord, who now lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit as one God forever and ever. Amen. <clears throat> Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the bread we offer you, fruit of the earth and work of human hands, and we come for us the bread of life. Blessed are you, Lord, God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the wine we offer you, fruit of the vine and work of human hands will become our spiritual drink. Pray, brothers and sisters, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of his name, for our good and good of all his holy church. May 
pay these sacrificial offerings, O Lord, become for you a pure oblation and for us a holy outpouring of your mercy through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation always and everywhere to give you thanks, Father, most holy, through your beloved Son, Jesus Christ. Your words in whom you made all things, whom you sent as our Savior and Redeemer, incarnate by the Holy Spirit and born of the Virgin, fulfilling your will and gaining for your holy people, he stretched out his hands as he endured his passion, so as to break the bonds of death and manifest the resurrection. And so with the angels and all the saints, we declare your glory, as with one voice we acclaim. Holy, 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 holy Lord, Lord God, God of hosts. Heaven and earth are full of your glory. Oh, Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the font of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, these gifts, we pray, by sending down your spirit upon them like the dew fall, so they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and giving thanks, broke it, gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice and once more giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples saying, take this all of you and drink from it for this is a chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith. We proclaim your death, O Lord, and profess your resurrection until you come again. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks and fellows for to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly, we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity together with Francis, our Pope, and Donald, our Bishop, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, Blessed Joseph, her spouse, the Blessed Apostles, and all the saints who please you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with him and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. The Savior's command and formed by divine teaching, we dare to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil, graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the, the kingdom, kingdom, the power, power and the glory, glory are yours, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Lamb of God, you, you take, take away the sins, sins of the world. world. Have, Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away <clears throat> the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Grant us peace. Behold the Lamb of God. Behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, Lord I, am I am not worthy, worthy that you should enter under, under my roof, 
but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed. And again, if you take out your living with Christ or your word among us, let us say together the communion antiphon. You will show me the path of life, the fullness of joy in your presence, O oh Lord. And again, in your charity today, do remember to pray for the poor souls whom we offer this Mass. let us pray. May the working of your power, O Lord, increase in us, we pray, so that reward, renewed by these heavenly sacraments, we may be prepared by your gift for receiving what they promise through Christ our Lord. Amen. Now, Galen cannot answer this question, but I'm going to ask you. Tomorrow, we're not going to have Mass here. Do you know why? We're going to have Mass in Artesian. Does that give you a hint? It's the feast day of St. Charles Barameo. <laughs> so as a result, we are going to celebrate the Mass at St. Charles Barameo. And I do that because the church grants us an indulgence for anybody that will make the sacrifice, make the, the time to come and go to the church that is dedicated to a particular saint. So just as we did with St. Wilfred uh, earlier this month, now we will do it with St. Charles, well, I should say back in November, October, but we'll do the same uh, uh, celebration with St. Charles Barameo Tesian. So that's going to be at 4 p.m., 4 p.m. So there will be no mass uh, live streamed. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. And may Almighty God bless you, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in peace. Thanks be to God. God.